On Tuesday, there was what was called the Sullivan County Workforce Summit at the Cartwright Grand Ballroom in Monticello. Dozens of business representatives and various support groups were there to get and provide information about hiring people with disabilities. The director for the Center for Workforce Development, Laureen Gabeline, explains. People with disabilities can work one, two days a week. They can, you know, do many things. They're ready, willing, and able to show up for work where some people aren't. Um, these people deserve to have a life and to be part of society and be sustainable in Sullivan County. Business representatives came to learn and support the county's efforts to employ people with disabilities. Coles Corporation was one of them. John Cronin is the HR manager for Coles Distribution in Wordsboro. It's a physical challenge versus a cognitive challenge. We would work with those individuals. Right now we're working with Sullivan County to see if there's opportunities for them to come in, not work directly for Coles, but work for the county, and then Coles would reimburse the county for their work that they come and produce for us. There are many social services available for people who need help, get information, or want to get a job. Hope Not Handcuffs was there to represent people who are in recovery from alcohol or drug use. Joan Ruiz explains. I think it is important that we do advocate for those that are in recovery because they deserve a chance at having a lifestyle, getting a job, and being able to get hired and making a living for themselves. I'm Jim Sebastian, MidHudsonNews.com.